ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದು ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಹೋದಿ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕ ಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಶಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ವಶಕಿಪಾಸಿಂಧುಭವಶ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂ ಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲ ಪಂಗುಂಗ್ಲಹತಿ ಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂ ಬಂದಿ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವಿ ತುಳಸಿ ದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾ ವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಸ ಕೃಷ್ಣಭಕ್ತಿಪದೆ ದೇವೀ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರುಂಜೈವ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವೀಂ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುಧೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪತ್ರಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಚ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ವರುಣ ಧ್ಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟೂಹ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವ ವಿರಂಚನು ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯ ಭೀತ್ತಾತ್ಯುಹಂ ಪುನತಪಾಲ್ ಭವಾದ್ದಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೇ ಚರುಣಾರವಿಂದ ಯತ್ ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನಖಚಂದಮನಿಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗೋಧೂಷು ಅದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರ ಸಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾ ಕೃಪಾಂ ಕರೋಷಿ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಅದ್ವೈತಗಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಅದ್ವೈತಗಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸತಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಆಯಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನುಕಾ ಬುಧಾತ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈಕರು ಕಮಲಾಯಕ್ಷ ವೀಶಾಂಬರು ದ್ವಿಜವರು ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೋ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭುತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರಿ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೇ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿತೋ ದಿವ್ಯೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ ಸದಾ ನರನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯಜಟಾಕಲಾಪಂ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭೂಷಿತ ವಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯಮನಂಗುಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವರಾನಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭೋಜವಿಶ್ವನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಜುಷ್ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಸ್ ಚ ಭಕ್ಷಸಿ ಜಸ್ಯಾಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬೀತ್ ತ್ಸಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ತ್ವಂ ಭಕ್ತಿಯೋಗ ಪರಿಭಾವಿತ ಹಿತ್ಸರೋ ಜ್ವಾಸಸೆ 
सुतेक्षित पतनुनुनाथ पुंसा जद जद धिया तो उर्गा विभावती तत्वपू प्रणय से सदनु गुहायु ताम भक्ति योग परिभावित हित सरो जो आस से सुतेक्षित पतनुनुनाथ पुंसम यद यद धिया तो उर्गा विभावती तत्वपू प्रणय से सदनु गुहायो गौरिय गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी डॉक्टर प्रभुपा परमंश से परमंश जगदगुरु सेट दे एट एनी सिचुएशन आई एम पुट इन टू आई शुड थिंक इट इज अ कृपा ऑफ भगवान गौरिय गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी डॉक्टर प्रभुपा परमंश जगदगुरु सेट दे A pure devotee cannot have any complaint. A pure devotee cannot have any complaint. Though sometimes protesting, that is out of causeless mercy. Somebody can say, "Why Pope is speaking this way? Why? This is not complaint. This is not complaint. Actually, Pope is speaking. Sometime." pure guru vishnu they are bound to speak heavily to rectify the situation that is not criticism that is actually they are causeless mercy for why they are crying inside heart all the time to rectify the situation that's why they are speak that can but cannot be compared With other so-called devotees criticizing, it cannot be compared. Guru Vishnu is not going to get result for this kind of heavy speech, because they are speaking out of their causeless mercy. Pope is speaking. I cannot fear to speak heavily. Somebody can say, Maharaj, the whole world can come to attack me. Why are you are speaking this way? Pope is speaking. If my life is completely dedicated for that absolute truth, if my life is completely dedicated for that absolute truth, then what I am speaking, standing on absolute platform, absolute way, all responsibility can go to that absolute truth, not me. nobody can attack me because all responsibility going to that absolute truth that absolute truth can come personally or through some sequence arrangement so that nobody can attack him but slight jealousy there if i have some jealousy against somebody then immediately they can attack me Bhagwan cannot take any responsibility. That is why in Upanishad it is written. That is why Bhakti Mr. Thakur writing what writing? In Upanishad it is written, Yasmin Sarvani Bhutani Atmi Bahut Bijanataha Tatra Koso Koso Gaku Moho Ekottam Anuvashataha. they are established in advaigan tattva i can come to the point what jiva go simba want to say they are established they can see all diversity but still they know all single tattva advaigan tattva that's why maya devi cannot make full of them upanishad speaking when i can see that absolute truth paramatma bhagwan inside everybody then all different kind of diversity cannot divert me my attention i cannot see any beautiful girl i cannot see any handsome boy i cannot see any you know i cannot see it cannot make full out I cannot see poisonous snake. 
I cannot see enemy. He can attack me. Snake is there. He can be, bite you. Some Mataji speaking to Gaurkishar Bhaj Maharaj in his bhajan kuti at the bank of Ganga. Shouting, that Mataji shouting, young Mataji. Baba, Baba, the snack is there. Can beat you. Baba cannot see eyes. Where is snack? Where is snack? Hey, he just has gone. Here. We are supposed to bite you. Gorkhisa Babaji Maharaj speaking. Let the snack bite me. I want it. Because why, why I can leave? What is the utility of my life? What is the snack? He is speaking. Let snack bite me. Because they are sure snack cannot bite. One pure sadhu, not Gauriya sadhu, from Nimbarka Sampadaya. He was there in Gorakhpur. I mean, Gita Press, you heard the name of Gita Press? You know, no. They are getting government facility. Long ago they started, they are giving, printing books and distributing very cheap. Kita Press. That editorial building, big building, and down some sadhus, sometime coming and staying. Staying there. One sadhu, very old, very old, but is very nice sadhu. Nimbarka Sampada. He is doing parikram, of some Girira Sila and Tulsi kept is doing Parikram. And in Parikram, some garden is there and is doing Parikram with a stick very slowly. And he discovered one poisonous snake is there in the way. You see, snake is there. Baba speaking, hey, go, go away. The snake being a fast with a stick. With the stick, hey, go, go, the snack force. Then other sadhus, they get information, they come all around, oh, Baba, you are playing with your life. Then one sadhu, he is having complete every idea, tattva He is speaking, no. He is not playing with that poisonous snack. He's playing. We see. He's playing with the poison of sex. No. He's playing with Paramatma. He's playing with Bhagavan. Yes. Because inside the snack, that Paramatma is there. Supreme Lord. He's playing. 100% believe. He's playing. Ha! Go. Then the snack go away. This kind of belief we cannot develop. Cannot develop. If we can develop, the day we can develop, then all success can come all around. Nobody can do anything. Let people attack me for speaking that absolute truth. Because I am not responsible for that. Bhagavan give me order, Guru Vaishnav give me order, that's why I am speaking. Somebody can think me enemy. It is their privilege. They can think me enemy. Okay, let them think. But I know myself, I'm not enemy of anybody. I'm 100% sure I'm not enemy of anybody. That's why I am. So, at any situation I am put into, I should become satisfied. I should feel happy. According to my karma fall, I am now in this situation. So whom to blame? Whom to blame? Nobody to blame. We cannot engage Bhagavan in our own seva. That is not called bhakti, it is called abhakti. We cannot engage Bhagavan in our seva. In other dharma sampradaya, X, Y, Z, even Christian sampradaya also speaking, Oh God, give our daily bread. But this is not our prayer. But it's so cheap. Even our pure Guru Varga, they hate their body. They hate their body. They hate. <laughs> Useless. 
I need to take rest. I need to go to, you know, uh, here and there, you know, for protecting my body. I need to take, I need to go to bathroom. Why? Different kind of disease coming. They hate their body. Because they know it is matter. It's matter. They have no love for their own body. But we are too much attached with your material body and things related to material body and mind. The situation of the whole world, especially devotional world, Bhakti Jagat, so contaminated, so contaminated, so contaminated. Some driving forces there, I don't like to name them. Some driving forces there, they are going to regulate the whole society. They are going to driving for. They are going to lead whole world towards hell. They are not guiding properly. They are not speaking about the absolute truth. They are not speaking about that. In the name of Harikata Harivajan, they are going to cheat people. I can show them they are not busy. They can show they are, they are busy, very much busy. They can show. It's one kind of drama. They can show I'm so much busy. Even I cannot stay here. One hour here, two hour here. Then after that I need to sit there. I have so much engagement. I have no engagement you have. I can prove. If I cannot prove, I can throw everything. I can prove I have no engagement. It is one kind of drama. It is one kind of drama. Baba speaking, he is sadhu who is always busy with Bhagavan Harikatha Kirtan. Prabhupada, you open Upadeshamrita, I can show you. He, who is always busy with Nam Sankirtan Harikatha, is there he is sadhu. As a re responsible person, as a responsible person, you are entrusted with this duty, but you are not doing you are not protesting against those who are against Gauriya Mat. Those who are speaking wrong Siddhanta. You are not writing any article. You are not speaking Harikatha. What kind of engagement? You show me? You show me, I like to hear Harikatha. I like to hear from you. What Harikatha you are speaking? So, it's very dangerous situation. If you need to write article like Prabhupada continuously to stop this kind of, you know, rubbish, you know, situation. Those who are antagonists, they are writing so many things. But you have not... Some of your disciples like to write, you say, no need of writing, you stop, stop. That's when your disciple, he is inspired by Marikatha. He likes to write something, but you say, no need of writing, stop, stop. Because I need money. Money is all. Money is not second God. Money is first God. By chance, it is their highness. It is their highness they are speaking. Money is the second God. I like to catch their lotus feet. It is your highness that by chance you are not speaking that money is the first, first God. You could see because you are powerful. Their dawn. Their dawn, you know, dawn. Dawn. You don't know, don't. Past, previous week I was explaining. Mafia, don't. Like to regulate the whole. All mafia sitting, sports field, medicine field, medicine field, treatment field, doctor's field, all everywhere mafia. Where not? Everywhere mafia. Now we can get pet degree of IAS phase fake degree De all fake degree fake degree doctor fake degree if you go to hospital you cannot come back all fake degree they are taking money and giving certificate this way a spiritual also 
world also, full of fake degree. No reality in it. I cannot believe them. Those who believe Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Pad, Prabhupada, they cannot believe this dirty, you know, bhajan field. They cannot believe. They know they are driving some unknown driving force. They are driving the whole world towards hell. And their condition is such painful that they even they cannot come back again. It is written in Shastra. It is written in Shastra. They cannot come back. They gone mean gone. It is written. Jo bhakti nairohitam annayena srinatuya to ubho brajataha nirvayam kalam akshayam. For infinity period they can go to hell. This is the condition. We like to engage Bhagavan, Guru, Vaishnava, all for my service. This is our Guru Seva. Yesterday I was speaking in Bengali Katha. If at all, if at all you have done Guru Seva, if at all you have done Guru Seva, then how you are doing Logu Seva, Maya Seva? How? You cannot make fool of me. You cannot make fool of Prabhupada and Guru Varga. If at all you have done Guru Seva, if I take it as grand, okay, then how you are eh, running for Logu Seva? That's when you are not done Guru Seva. It was one kind of business. He wanted to give something to Guru Seva, he wanted to get something in return. But we like to pay Pranam, Dandavad, and to a lotus with a Bali Maharaj. It is because it is because he got the association of Prahlad Maharaj. So he never wanted to become a businessman. Never wanted to become a businessman. He is growing tremendous, endless patience. Endless patience. How? Without Vaishnava, nobody can grow this kind of patience. Only Vaishnava. Like Haridas Thakur or other, you know, patience. Only those are Vishnu. Without Vaishnav, nobody can develop this kind of patience. Brikho Janu Katilu Kishuna Buloy Sukhaya Mui Lekare Panina Mangoy Jeja Mangwe Tare Deya Pondhan Gharma Vishti Sahaya Anir Karoy Rakshan. Bengali version. Of the Tinada Vishuni Sloka, written by Sela Sachidan Bhakti Muttaku, is writing. Is writing. Like trees, you are going to cut. It's not, why you are cutting me? I have given so much fruits and leave everything to you. It's not speaking. Okay, you can cut me. And nobody giving water, drought everywhere. But he's not asking, give me some water. I am thrust you, not give us. Not speaking. A Vaishnava is like that. Haridas Sakur, he was beaten in 22 different markets. But still no complaint. Maybe it is a desire of Bhagavan. They never feel nervous. You are feeling nervous. Because your attention is not on the lotus feet of Bhagavan, Guru, Vishnu. Your attention is towards money. That's why feeling nervous to speak Harikatha. Feeling nervous of so many people, but I can see. And if one pure sadhu is there, then again you can become so much nervous. Because if Acharansil sadhu is there, I am speaking about my practical experience. I am not speaking any story. I am not speaking any story. Even before coming here, ten minutes before, I was not taking decision to speak this way. But coming. Practical experience I am speaking. If one Acharan Sadhu, Acharan Sadhu is present there in the Sabha, in their assembly, then everybody feeling fear. Who is there? What I can speak? If I speak something, then he can catch immediately. He cannot feel free. He 
cannot feel fear. I have seen very much fear. This is the condition. I have nothing to do. I am trying my best. But I, I know, no, I know I can get some divine help from up. Nobody can help me here. Divine help Bhagavan can give. With this hope I am trying. So, we can pay Dandavat Pranam unto the lotus feet of Sri Bali Maharaj, who is enjoying, who is enjoying the full kipa of Bamanji Maharaj. Bamandev. Bhagavan Bamandev. Our Jayadev Goswami writing, Keshavadita Bamana Rupa Jai Jagadisha Hare Jai Jagadisha Hare Keshavadita Bamana Rupa Jai Jagadisha Keshavadita Kurma Sarira Jai Jagad Keshavadita Meena Sarira Jai Jagad Keshavadita Shukara Rupa Jai Jagadisha. All Keshav. Bhagavan taking the form of different avatars. So Bhaman Devji Maharaj Bhagavan is the Supreme Lord Himself. He is Supreme Lord Himself. Kashyap Aditi. Coming to bestow kipa on demigods? No. Because there is two types of kipa. One is cheating kipa, another is actual kipa. So if you, I already gone through Brihad Bhagavad Mrito, two years back, you can go back there. Yeah. I discuss about Bhamanji Maharaj. Actually, Bhamanji Maharaj, Bhaman Bhagavan appeared to help demigods, I mean elder brother Indra, to get back his own position. Right? Because he was out of his position. He was out, of, he was displaced, na? When Bari Maharaj acquired everything, they gone. Because of gu, uh, offense unto the lotus feet of Guru Dev. All uh, like Bregar, in the Maha, traveling here and there, like Bregar. Then after that, Dithima started Payabrata. Paya means only some milk can drink in a whole Brata period. During, during, during the Brata period, a Brata duration is only 12 days, but every day, you can only drink milk, nothing else. There are so many rules and regulations. So many rules and regulations to do some chant, some mantra, special mantra. After that, Purasharan invite some pure Brahman. It depends upon whatever mantra you are doing, how many times, how many times you are doing. According to that calculation, you will have to invite Brahman, pure Brahman. Every day can give. Follow. This way is the Paya Brata. So, Dithima, Shiva successful. So many rules and regulations, I am not speaking. Bhagavan was very, very much satisfied with her. He came to bestow Kipa on him. What Kipa you know, Mother? Actually, I already know what is there inside your heart. Actually, I know. I am aware about what is there inside your heart. Okay, still, actually, all my sons, they are like beggar running here and there. You know, they are not, they are displaced from their own position. Why not you please, you know? Okay. Very shortly, very shortly you can discover, very shortly you can discover all your sons, demigods, in their own position as they were before. Promise. And Bhamanji Maharaj coming in the form of her son. Coming in the form of son. 
after taking birth, you know, when this, you know, sanskar, genuine sanskar time, then all Rishi Muni, they are sitting, going to do some. Then after taking, Yagya Pobhid, everything, with small wooden chapel, everything, with umbrella and, and a kamandul, you know, water pot and stick, going to bake. Because it is the rules. Are going. Where are going? Directly going nowhere. Directly going according to his previous plan. Where? Brigukacha Sangakaha, that place is at the bank of Narmada River. Narmada. Gange Chujamuna Chaivo Gudavari Sharasati Narmade Sindhu Kaviri Yalas means Narmada. Going to Narmada. At the bank of Narmada, at the bank of Narmada, there is big Jagya going on. Big Jagya. But the Jagya arranged by, arranged by whom? Bali Maharaj. Jagya going on. Bhrigu Kacha. Then there, Mamandev coming. Too much effulgence. Oh, like sun god. Oh, somebody coming. When the Bhamandev coming, find a short figure. Brahman boy, he get up, everybody. There are some heavy, heavy, get up. Oh, it's coming. What I can do for you? I can give you bhiksha. Whatever you need, I can give one continent or whatever you need, I can give you. Are you just? But Bali Maha speaking, I only need three steps of my this step of land, my footstep of land. Ah, this person, your leg is so much small, and this with three legs, what do you, you cannot even see it. Even to put one asana in one place, you need um, uh, you know, a little bigger place. No, I need that one. You think, you try to think again and again. I think you are not aware about your self-interest. Balima is speaking, I am sure you are small figure, small you know, boy, you have no interest, you have no, you know, idea about your self-interest. What are you going to do? Huh? I can give one continent? No, I don't. Uh -oh. Then one Barsha, Bharat Barsha, Ilavad, Ilavita, any Barsha you can, no, I don't. Achha, okay, that you can take some, uh, you know, five, ten village? No, I don't. Need. Then how you can eat, what you can take? Even you cannot arrange, earn money. If it's a sizable amount of land and property there, you can arrange your bread, tell it. Bhamandev Maharaj speaking, one pure sadhu can maintain his power because he has no desire for anything. Bhamandev Maharaj speaking clearly, those who are having some greed, those who are having some greed for money, position, surely they cannot keep power. Their power can go away. Those who are powerful, you can watch them. They are less interested to take anything. And by chance they give, okay, I can use. No attachment. That the same thing Bhaman Maharaj wanted to speak in front of Bali Maharaj. Oh, Rajan! There is Goy, Nahush, all big, big sadhus, they never got satisfaction. Bhamanda is speaking to Bali Maharaj. Come on. That Goy Maharaj and all big, big, you know, they never got satisfaction in their life by acquiring land and property, everything. So why should I do it? You like to give it or not? Oh, I can go. No, 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 I can give you. You like to give it? That's why it is Bhamandev speaking. Jadrichalavena Santushta Sho and Santushto Biprasho Tejo Varta. Ta tej, I mean the power increasing. Those who are satisfied with whatever things coming to them. They are coming. The, but now I am going to discuss about Bhamandev Ji Bhagavan. Bhamandev. 
Actually, Bamandev wanted to make full of those demigods. Really so. And Bamandev Ji Maharaj wanted to give actual kipa to Bali Maharaj. But the whole world, they are foolish. They say, giving punishment. Why giving punishment, everything? Even Brahma requesting Prabhu. He is giving everything to you. Why you are going to buy? Then Bhagavan speaking. Brahma, try to hear. Whom, whom I am going to bestow actual kipa, I am going to take away everything from him. Land, property, everything. That I can make him bigger. Actual kipa, if I bestow on somebody, here so many questions can come. Bhagavan speaking this way. That doesn't mean you can speak about Yudhishthira Maharaj. Because their Siddhanta is there, Yudhishthira Maharaj think himself Niskinchan, Gregor. Everything I am doing by the desire of Krishna. I never wanted to arrange Rashtriya Jagga. What is the utility? I never wanted. So, Yudhishthira, you cannot compare the case with Yudhishthira Maharaj, Prahlad Maharaj. You cannot compare Dhuva Maharaj. They are going to live here. Everything. Externally you see everything. All there, but not actually. So, Bhagavan speaking, Jam anagrinami tad visho vidunomi aham Whom I am going to bestow actual kipa, I am going to take away those objects. Which object? Due to those objects, his feeling popped up. I mean the object for which that devotee, subs, he can feel any man, I am going to best to keep on him. If he is feeling some, you know, false ego due to uh, money, position, honor, everything, then I like to take away from him. I like to snatch away. Follow. So that he can feel helpless, then I can feel helpless and he can surrender unto me. Like the case of Tridandi Vikshuk. Tridandi Vikshuk. He was just helpless. All family men going to kick him out. All property is gone. Some properties and everything, money, property, everything taken by the king. And the rest was stolen by dacoits, everything. And it's not penniless. Now the family members, they kick him out. He's coming out and thinking, I don't know the reason for why I am feeling satisfaction and burdenless. Now I am feeling totally burdenless. I like to fly in the sky. I am feeling free. Why? Well, all my burden gone. It is kipa. Why should I think, oh, Bhagavan is merciless, going to make me, oh. Bhakti Mithagur, that's why I wrote. Jado vidya jato mayar vaibhav tumar bhajane vadha anitya sangsare mahajan miya jivke karay gadha. All those big, big lawyers, all big, big doctors, all big, big, you know, magistrate, they are going to take burden on their backside. Oh, give me burden. Like ass, you know. Burden. And those pure sadhus, they are feel free. Hey, you go away from temp temple. You are making problem. Yes, he is making problem. Because he is speaking absolute truth. He is not the burden of temple. He is the property, treasure of temple. But you are idiot number one. That's why you could not realize. That's why you could not realize the property. Bhaktivinoda Tagore is going to identify himself. I am the dog of my Guru Bhargava. Sarvasya tomar charane shopiya parichi tomaro ghare Tumi to thakuro tomaro kukuro Baliya jano ho more. This is dog. 
Those pure devotees, they always identify them. I am the dog of my Guru Bhargava. I will have to protect at any cost. If you will have to kill me, but still, at the last moment, I will have to arrange the protection, for the protection and preservation of all of our Gauriya treasure. You are the miscreant. You are the hijacker. You are the dawn of an underworld world. Under one world man, underground world man, they cannot understand. He's a boss. Nobody can understand. They are making fool of them. Like magic. PC Sarkar magic filler, some magic. So hey, why you are coming four hours late? Eh? We are for four hours waiting. And for two hours, not four hours. Two hours late you are. PC Sarkar, the topmost magician in the world. He was from India. Why why I'm late? Who told I am late? Two hours late you are. You, you watch your, you, you see your, you know, she watch. They all say, no, it's four o'clock. No late. It's going to make some magic. Why late? I am coming on punctual time. Four o'clock. But it's not four o'clock, six o'clock. It's kind of magic. Now black magic, this, that, so many people, okay? But I say you, black magic cannot touch you. If you can remember, Guru Vaishnava Bhagavan, black magic can go back to him or her to kill. Black magic cannot do anything. I promise you, if you can remember Guru Vaishnava Bhagavan, black magic cannot do anything. Those who are having loose character, those who are having no acharan, for them black magic effective. Otherwise, cannot do. So, Bhakti Muntag was speaking. Bhakti Muntag was speaking. I am the dog of my Guru Varga. I like to protect. This is the mood of your Guru. So, if Guru Vaishnav like to cheat me, then I can say, he's nice, nice devotee. My Gurudev is very nice. If Gurudev is going to speak high, why you can go to foreign country? Why? What for? Keno jabe. Then you think Gurudev is very dangerous. Why you can go? Why? What for? Why not you do sit here and do preaching? Sit in one place. You sit in one place. By sitting in one place, one pure devotee can preach, preach all over the world very easily. By sitting in one place. Because their acharan is preaching. I have no time to discuss all about it. But told, if you are totally established in the acharan of Gauranga, it is itself preaching. Where Gaur, where Gaur Kishore Bhaji Maharaj gone? America or Russia? Never. But his name is all around the world. Bhakti Mahapurika is where gone? All around the world, everywhere. You can find New York airport, you can find the photo of Bhakti Mahapurika. Washington, photo of. So why? Where gone? Where gone? It is naturally. Madhavandhu Puripa, where gone? He wanted to hide himself. Oh, morning time, everybody can give water in my lotus feet. No. Can. Madhavandhu were flying. But Pratishta flying behind him. He written. He written Chaitanya Chaitanya. Pratishta shabab ei jaina chahe tar har hoi. Vidata Nirmito. Pratishtat. So, Bhamandev Ji Maharaj giving to give the topmost Pratishtha. Bhamandev Ji Maharaj, we are thankful to Bhamandev Ji Maharaj, Bhaman Bhagavan. He is going to give topmost Pratishtha to Bali Maharaj. Because one Vaishnav is enjoying the topmost Pratishtha. I am the millionaire, is not Patishtha. I am a big boss, is not Patishtha. It is written, Vaishnavi Patishtha, Tate Koranishtha, Tahana Kurile, Lobiba Rura. So, if you become Vaishnav, that means you are going to get the topmost Patishtha in the infinity world. Because Bhagavan is going to honor you. That is it. Hello. So, we are thankful, ever grateful 
to Bhaman Bhagavan because he is giving first priority to this Bhaman Dev Maharaj, to Bali Maharaj, for his devotional mood. When Bhamanji Maharaj is going to put his leg on the head of Bali Maharaj, it is rare. It is rare. It is rare. You cannot see, you cannot show anybody. The Bhagavan is going to give head, leg on his head. Only Kaliya, that was all special circumstances. I am already discussing yesterday. That was special. Because he wanted to give punishment and wanted to establish some. But anyway, Kalyonag was giving kipa, but he was giving punishment. But here, Bali Maharaj, in the name of punishment, giving full kipa. There also, but a special kipa. Special kipa. So, Bali Maharaj can be counted in the list of those Mahabhagavat. We count the name of Bali Maharaj. Shayangbur Narada Sambhu Kumar Kapilo Manu Prahlad Vishma Janako Vishma Prahlad Vishma Janako Balir Vyasakir Vayam Dada Saita Vijanimo Dharmam Bhagavatam Bhatta Guiham Vishuddhyam Durvadhyam Yadgyatta Amrita Masnute So, we can count Bali Maharaj, not Indra Maharaj. We can count the name of Bali Maharaj not the name of Indra Maharaj. Maybe he is the king of heaven. We can count the name of Bali Maharaj as Mahabhagavat, who is having Tattva Vigyan, Bhagavat Tattva Vigyan. But not Indra Maharaj. So, Guru Vaishnava sometimes giving you punishment. But you think, he is so much angry against me. But the foolish don't know, he is going to give Kipa. When our Nityananda was going to provide a big kick on the chest of Shivananda, what? You are not coming, I am hungry, not coming. But everybody thinking Nityananda will become angry, so going to provide a kick on the chest. But Shivananda, I understand. Oh, I am so lucky. You are going to make me, make me the sole authority of Gauranga Prema. Soul authority. Externally, Nityananda is going to kick. But that kick is not kick. It's called kipa. If at all Nityananda is going to bestow special kipa to Sivananda, I come to me, hey, you are not giving to me. Everybody can you are not giving to me. Why giving to him? So better can give kick. A kick means, oh, giving punishment. They cannot understand. They are actual kipa. Foolish world, they need to wait crores of life to realize this kind of secret bhakti, you know, mood. This way, Bhamanji, Bhaman Bhagavan, today, this day, is a special day when Bhamanji Maharaj is going to put the lake on them. Because in the name of three steps of land, small, small, he has taken the whole universe, everything. Bhaman Maharaj is not going to start argument. That was not the condition. You have shown small leg and three step. Now we are going to show everything. So I can file one case against you. <laughs> not going to speak. Speak? Well, you wanted to take uh, this. Uh, your leg is very small, three step. Now you are going to take everything. So I can file one case against you. Not. Bali Maharaj, when, when, when Shukrajaja wanted to stop, hey, don't give donation. Don't give donation. Is, is Vishnu, is Vishnu going to come and take everything? Esho Vishnu Abhayaha. Hey, Vishnu himself coming to take everything for you. Bali Maharaj thinking, I thought he is a Brahman boy. Now you point out he is Vishnu, then I can give hundred percent. Hundred percent? Yes. I cannot obey 
the advice of material guru to die. Foolish. I cannot obey. I cannot sacrifice my life and do a lotus piece of foolish cheat, cheater guru. I cannot sacrifice my life. Let the whole world go. What I can do? Let them die. I wanted to protect them, but they do not, don't never want to be protected. So, we are really. So, Bali Maharaj speaking, I thought he is a Brahman boy, but now you point out he is Vishnu, then I can give 100%. Oh, really? You are going to ignore me? Eh? I can curse you. He, he, eh? All Rajya Lakshmi, La, Rajya Lakshmi can go away from you. You can be devoid of Rajya Lakshmi. Then everything gone. Even Bali Maharaj has not even a small piece of land where you can stand at least. All taken. I all taken, then where I then rest my third leg where can by two leg I take everything. And the third leg where to keep? Third leg coming from here. Bhagavan Bhavandev take the form of Tivikram. Bhagavan Bhavandev taking the form of Tivikram, taking everything. Then Bindha Bindhavali, the wife of Bali Maharaj speaking, why not you keep your head? You say the third head, third third leg you can put here. More practical. Then Bali Maharaj said, Well, you can put your leg here. Then Bhagavan become very happy. Bhagavan wanted to. Then Bali Maharaj. Bali Maharaj giving the head. And Bamandev going to put your leg. Bamandev was, you know, Nagpash. Nagpash, one, one bind. One snack is there. Nag is going to try it. Now you are under arrest. You are under arrest. Everything gone. Now Bali Maharaj speaking, well, I can give the rest. He is in my place. Then Brahma become very sorry. Prabhu, he's going to offer everything to you. Why you are going to give Prabhu? Why not you make him free? Then Bhagavan speaking, Jam Anugrinami Tad Visho Vidunomi Aham. He is my keeper. Hey Asura Raj, you now go to Sutalam, Sutal, Atal Bital, Talatal, Sutal, Patal, Sab. You go there. There you can get immense property. More and more than the kingly heaven, king of heaven, you can get. And I myself can stay in the gate as a gatekeeper, right? So, a skipper or a skipper or not? A skipper. Anyway, Bhamandev Ji Maharaj Ki Jai Ho. And today is also the Abhir Bhaktiti, appearance day of Silo. Our Jiva Goswami path. I have no time because you are not giving me time. I am coming on time, but you are making me late. For that, I don't know you can get punishment, surely. Because every day you are going to break. I have no time. How I can speak? I have to start Harikatha there immediately. And to cross the river is very dangerous. Strong wind, I cannot do. So anyway, Balima, our... Jibu Goswami Bhatt is the topmost Tata Charya who wanted to establish the teachings of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Some of our so-called devotees and Acharyas, they are against Mahaprabhu. They say, uh, actually, Achinta Vedavet Tattva was introduced by Jibu Goswami Bhatt, they say. But actually not so. Achinta Vedavet Tattva was already established by Sivan Mahaprabhu himself. Not only that, but also on the basis of this Achinta Vidyavet Tattva, Mahaprabhu wanted to show the harmony between all four different sampradayas. Basically, all sampradayic acharyas, they are dealing with the same thing. Almost with the same thing. What? They are dealing with almost the same thing. What is? One is Jiva, Jiva Tattva, Bhagavad Tattva, eh? 
Kal, Kal, Sama, you know, all this Tattva. They are going to deal with this. Jeev, Ishwar, Kal, Karmo, all these kind of things. They are dealing with the same. Only the representation, representation is a little bit different. But Mahaprabhu wanted to show the two complete harmony by applying this Achinta Vedavata Tattva. It is really so. What Bhakti Mir Chakra told? Amna yo praha tatyam hari miho. Amna yo praha tatyam hari miho sarva sadhin. This sloka Mahaprabhu told. A Mahaprabhu wanted to show Bhakti Mir Chakra. Amna yo praha tatyam hari miho sarva sadhin. Amna yo praha tatyam hari miho sarva तद बिन्नांश अंश जीवान प्रकृति का बलितानो तद बिन्नुस्तांश भावाद भेदा भेद सकलमों पी हरे हे स्वाद्धम शुद्ध वक्तिम हैं एंड द अटेनेबल ऑब्जेक्ट शाद्यो तत्प्रीति में वो इति उपदेशति गोरो चंदो स्वयं सा हे हिमसेल्फ टोल प्रीति आई मीन प्रेम प्रेम is the ultimate object. I can discuss very haphazardly, I cannot discuss it with very big problem. So, Jiva Goswami Bhad wanted to establish this tattva, all Vedanta Sutta, all on the basis of Achinta Vedavata Tattva. Someday, if I can get time, I can discuss. And Jiva Goswami Bhad wanted to defend our total Gauriya Sampradaya. No father there still today. No father there in the whole universe who can go and fight against Jiva Goswami Path. So, so powerful. He is a son of actually Anupam, but she saw Gauranga Mahapu when Gauranga Mahapu when Gauranga Mahapu went to Ramkeli Gram to bestow Kipa on Rup Sanatan, that time the son of Anupam, Jiva Goswami came in the lap of father. Small, so he saw Gauranga Mahapu. And he left home very shortly, I mean, a small age. After that, came to Navadip Dham, Dan Parikrama under the guidance of Nityananda himself. After that, gone to by the order of Nityananda, gone to Varanasi to learn Vedanta, everything. Actually, they are already learned it. <laughs> but still, Madhusudan Sahasriba, he was the disciple of Sarbhavan Vartichajyo. He learned there. From there, Nityananda, you can go to Vrindavan and try to establish all Siddhanta. All Shatra Sandarbha, all commentary, everything, so valuable that uh, infinity period, if we like to pay something to Jiva Goswami Bhatt, we cannot give. Also, one last point I like to say, Jiva Goswami Bhatt, in Bhakti Shandarbha writing, that your Guru, now at present, just opposite teachings. Shiksha Guru and Diksha Guru, all same. It is written in Chaitanya Bhagavad Chaitanya everywhere. But still people don't obey. They like to maintain some color. Hey, don't go there. Maintain some color. I request them, those who are going to misunderstand me, those who cannot digest this kind of absolute truth, better they go away from me. Don't come to me. Now, when you can develop your power to digest, then you can come. Otherwise you go. With a party color, you go and stay. Don't come to me. I openly request them, don't come to me. You go better again, because you can develop offense. Guru Bhag Gaya, Guru Bhag Gaya, Tat Sevan Avirodheno Cha, Annesham Upi Vaishnamanam Sevanam Sriya. I can explain someday. What is the meaning? By taking the permission of Shadguru, if Ashadguru is there, no, I am not speaking. If Gurudev is already cheetah, I am not speaking. Shadguru. So Jiva Goswami was speaking, Gaurvag Gaya, by taking the order of Guru Padma, 
Tatsevan Abhiryadenacha. If my activities and seva not going to, not going against my main Guru Seva. When somebody hearing Harikatha, writing, translating, it is direct Guru Seva. You don't understand. Guru Seva, the gravity is there. So nobody can stop because Guru Seva. I am not doing Logu Seva. There are two Seva, na? one is Guru Seva, one is Logu Seva, Maya Seva. I have no right to stop, it is Guru Seva. I am not going to, and I am doing all Guru Seva, everything. What you order me, they are also doing. At the same time, I am doing also Guru Seva. I mean, open Guru Seva, what is called? Guru is one Tattva. So all, it is written by Jiva Goswami Bhad, you are 100%, you are allowed to do Guru Seva, because you are not doing Maya Seva. You are not doing Maya Seva, you are doing Guru Seva. But so, Guru Bhag Gaya Tat Sevam Avirodenach Avirodenach Annesham Api Vaishnavanam Sevanam Sreya. So, if I like to serve other pure Guru Vaishnav, those who are in line with our Guru Varga, then there is no harm in it. It is approved. It is written. It is written approved. Whereas you also approve. You also say, those you appear are going to get power by hearing Harikatha from Him, no, you can hear because that is the utility. So I don't know what is the fallacy. So I cannot explain the first slok I started with. Today I will have to stop anyway. I don't like to stop, but I will have to stop. Tvam bhakti yoga paribhavito hitsaro ju asase shutekshita patano nunat pungsam jad jad dhyato uruga jabi bhavayati tattadabapu pranayase sadano gruhayo one chakal pudrubhusigri kibasin the bhutyam gavana bhushna bhyo namun jai si jibuga shepad ji ki jai ho jai si bhamandevji maharaj ki jabali maharaj ji ki jai. Sapar Shasila Bhamandi, Gautamana.